Hello students, I am Krishna Verma. I am a mechanical engineer and I, I did my MTech from Bits Pilani. I am working as an assistant professor in a very renowned engineering college. Uh, I have six years of experience in teaching and uh, today I am going to start my online lecture session basically for mechanical engineering students. So I hope you will get the knowledge or as well as you will enjoy the lectures. So in this category, I will start with the very basic and very introductory subject of mechanical engineering that is strength of material or uh, we can say mechanics of material also. Uh, both are same. Mechanics of material and strength of material both are same. So uh, I will start with the strength of material. It is basically in third semester. So this is a very introductory subject of mechanical engineering. When you are going to start study of strength of material, the first question should raises in everybody's mind that is uh, what is the need to study strength of material or why we study strength of material and what is strength of material. So uh, for an efficient, a critical and a competitive design of any kind of machine or any kind of structure, it is very necessary to get the thorough knowledge of strength of material because every type of construction based on strength of material only that type uh, that structure can be a civil structure or that structure can be a mechanical structure or that can be a stable a chair any kind of structure so every kind of construction based on strength of material that is why we study strength of material so this is a very basic or very necessary subject for mechanical engineers as well as the civil engineers also. so uh, we'll start with the basic introduction of strength of material so what is strength of solid object which is subjected to stress and strain. The study of strength of material is often referred to various methods uh, of calculating the stress and strain in any type of structural or any, type, uh, any kind of solid uh, object which is subjected to different loads or which is subjected to different stress and strain. So basically this, is, this was the calculation of stress and strain for any kind of structural member. So the method employed for calculating the stress and strain is generally predict the behavior of solid object under loading as well as the susceptibility of various failure mode takes into account the various properties of materials such as yield strength, ultimate strength, poison ratio, uh, young modulus etc. as well as the uh, mechanical elemental macroscopic properties such as length, width, thickness, abrupt changes in geometry and uh, uh, different uh, uh, physical properties of material and uh, other properties of material as well. So uh, basically uh, to study the elastic and plastic behavior of material under certain loading condition uh, is the strength of material. So this was the very basic uh, definition of strength of material or very basic introduction of strength of material. In my further lectures, I will include all the fundamental as well as the advanced concept of strength of material. And uh, you can prefer some books also to study strength of uh, in my opinion, the book should be the first book uh, you should prefer. Uh, the book by Timo Shanko, 